We are under the lights as the show gets you ready for another edition of Major League Baseball. Coming up, we've got a good matchup in store between the Cleveland Indians and the Toronto Blue Jays. It's Blue Jays baseball, and it's on its way next. Joe Musgrove will be on the mound for the series opener. Dan Plezak, what do you got? Hey, Matt, if he were getting a chance to watch a guy that's been struggling good. a little bit lately. In his last three starts, he has a whip of over 1.40. Hey, so huh? he's going to have to cut that down, limit the amount of base runners, limit the amount of walks if he wants to have some success in this one here today. And that's into the gap and should be extra bases. And now he'll get into scoring position with two away. Well, you can see why these fans are so excited about this rookie. Yeah, Matt, and just a nice piece of hitting by this youngster. Not only does it look like he's going to be a solid contributor, it looks like he may be an impact player at the big league level for years to come. If he can continue to learn and develop, he looks good to me. Coming to the plate now, Vladimir Guerrero Jr. And you can see his home road splits there. He has not fared very well in front of the home crowd, oddly enough. But an easy play over at first to glove it. Digging in for his second at bat, Eddie James. He'll try to follow up the double in his last at bat with another big hit right here. Yeah, he jumped all over that first pitch last time up. Interested to see if he has the same approach this AB. From the stretch. Now here's a drive out to right center field. Make the turn. Go hard. Go hard. And they'll have runners at second and third following the one out double. Now's a good time for your pitcher to take a deep breath. He still has the lead, although it probably doesn't feel like it. So he can't worry about how he got into this mess. He just has to figure out how to get out of this mess. So stepping in, Vladimir Guerrero Jr. As he's got a chance to tie this ball game up with that equalizing run just 90 feet away at third. This is hit pretty well out to left field. Gone into the home bullpen for a home run. So a three-run blast is straight away left. Number 10 for him on the year. And with it, they've left in front now three to one. Wow, the pitching staff has to love this one, right? They were down one, and with one swing of the bat, they're up two. Now with the plate, Cesar Hernandez. Right Second base. Cesar. Ready with the first Hernandez. pitch. Here it comes. Hey, no outs here. Now a throw over, Stay. and the runner will get back standing. Now the 0-1. This is hit softly to third. A leaping try, but it's out of his reach and into the outfield. Boy, this is just a case of another really good hitter finding a way, even though that was a soft liner. So it's a runner at first with two men out. And up to bat. Next to Lino DeShields. Strike taken to throw. And he'll be tagged out at second base. Trying to get into scoring position, but instead the inning is over. Another look at the throw down that results in a third out on the bases. We're back to Friday Night Baseball on the show after this. So coming to the plate, the Eddie bat. James, the already pitcher. two for two. He'll Eddie. look to add on right here. Yeah. First pitch of the at-bat. Sent on the ground out to second. Reined in. And he'll whip out. this one over to first, and he gets his man for the second out. And here's the second generation big leaguer Delino DeShields. Fourth trip to the plate for him and he's at risk of ending that nice hitting streak that he's put together. Yeah chances are it's on his mind Matt but you just have to let that get out of the way as best you can. You have to approach this at bat just like any other. Otherwise you're just getting in your own way. The batter number seven. 
second base. Stepping in now, Cesar Hernandez. Trying to get that go-ahead run to scoring position now as he puts this one down. The second for one. Relay throw, but it'll be too late as he's... Digging in once again, Eddie James. He got on top of one and was a ground-out victim last time. Hey, let's go, big fella. Here comes the first pitch. Hit hard to the right side. And that is through into right field for a single. Hey, guys, I like the execution by the batter there. He got a hanger in the middle of the plate. He could have come unglued, but he didn't. He stayed focused and drove a line drive base hit. So a runner at first now with one now away, back. and Vladimir Guerrero base. Jr. settles Vladimir. in at the plate. Yeah, that, that last one wasn't exactly a tape measure shot, but listen, a home run is a home run. I know a lot of pitchers, they call that a wall scraper in his last hey, A.B., but listen, it counts as a home run nonetheless. Now at the plate, Kevin Biggio. He's got a Second hit in three at-bats to this Kevin. point. Biggio. Good lead off a second there, now the pitch. And here's a swing and a miss. And that, folks, is a big out number two. So here is Avisayo Garcia. He's the working on a one for three, three thus far. Avisayo Garcia. No one better, no one better. Fuck up right here. Three and one, here it is. That's the ball. And he get takes out, all out, four. So a good job out of the nine hole and getting on base as we go back to the top of the order. Coming forward now, the Toronto designated hitter, Steve Conrad. Conrad. And he comes back on, get to get, get him. Get so a great job pitching out of it with the bases loaded. Good. New inning set to get underway, and that'll bring up the outfielder, Yasmani Tomas. Yasmani Tomas. Try to bunt for a base hit here as he gets this one down. Throw to first will get him as they pounce on it quickly to snuff out the bunt attempt. Well, you know, he had... Yeah, and they just keep on keeping on. Got a nice little run going here, winning four in a row and playing with a lot of confidence. Success is never guaranteed in this game, so you have to appreciate it when it comes. And it's a 4-3 finish in this evening's ballgame. Toronto jumped ahead in the seventh inning and never gave the lead back. Robbie Erlin earns the victory in relief in this one, his seventh of the year. MLB The Show's coverage of Major League Baseball is on the air. Ought to be a good one here between the Cleveland Indians and the Toronto Blue Jays. The Blue Jays have won five games in a row. They'll look for number six right after this. Taiwan Walker is ready to go as he'll be on the mound for Toronto. Dan Plezak, what's the word on him? Hey, we're getting a chance to look at a guy that uh, he's a little bit up and down throughout points of his career. A career ERA just over four. When he's good, he can be really good. And when he's bad, well, let's just say he can be pretty bad at. Oh, and he misses it. There's one. Rowdy Tellez the next to bat. Two hits and eight tries for the series. Number 44. This is on the ground over to first. Oh, and he can't pick it up cleanly. Dig yourself. Set to get his day started, Travis Shaw. And it's been a real struggle for him with the bat so far this year. Looking to get things turned around in a hurry. Ground ball to second. This could be two. To second for one. On to first as they get the double played. Striding in for the Indians, Cesar Hernandez. Previously with Taiwan Walker, he's gone three for eight. He'll try to bunt his way on as he gets this one down. But the throw will beat him at first, so the bunt for hit attempt is snuffed out. Next to bat for Toronto, Eddie James. He's Eddie. 0 for 1 thus far. First pitch of the at-bat. A swing and a shot hit down the corner. 
And that's going to wind up hooking just a bit foul, so a missed opportunity there. Drilled right back up the middle. That's through for a base hit, and he's one for two now. Man, this guy's really starting to swing the stick again, d -Row. That extends his hitting streak to nine games. Yeah, he's it. leaking in the three Number series three. right here now. On, nine games, that's getting firm. He's seeing the ball well, and he's making the proper adjustments at the plate. And that'll get down for a base hit. He'll get it into second, and there are two away now. Settling in now, Eddie now James. He That's singled good. his last time Eddie. up. Yeah, and they take another yeah. single right here. That third base coach is dying to wave his arms. I wouldn't be surprised on, if on, anything hit hard through the infield. He's going to wave them. And that gets down as he can't get there in time. Tag, and he's out as he can't get back in. Standing in, now Eddie that. James. The he comes to the plate as the Eddie. last chance for his Eddie. side. Two out here in the ninth. Just able to get a piece of that for strike one. Bases are empty here with two men out. Pitch swung on and hit in the air toward the line in right. And that's going to put an end to this one. And the Indians have put an end to their four-game slide as this ball game is over. 5-3 to three the final score in this afternoon's game. The, the Cleveland Indians 